Good afternoon, punters, and welcome to another edition of Spruikers. And it's a rare day that we uh, put AFL or play AFL's second fiddle to the Olympics, Jake. It is second fiddle tags, and it's might I say it's been a big week for you, celebrating birthdays, dates with Miranda <laughs> Kerr. Punters, this man is on fire at the minute. I couldn't help that. She just called and got in touch. Well, I don't blame you. It's hard to knock her back. How did mum, how was mum when you knocked back the lamb roast? I didn't knock back the lamb roast. <laughs> I was hoping she got the opportunity to, but she didn't. Anyway, we'll move on and we'll talk about some footy. And we're, uh, we're going to look at Carlton versus the Kangaroos this week from Telstra Dome. Carlton $2.26, the Kangaroos $1.78. The Kangaroos have only started seven of their 18 games this year under even money, Jake. And uh, this is uh, the I eighth. I know that, Tang. It's a good little stat. Well played. This, yeah, they're perennial underdogs, it seems. And um, uh, probably not for the right reasons either, because they tend to win more than they lose. Yeah, well, they did the same thing last year, didn't they? By uh, yeah. finishing in the top four and going on to the preliminary final before being flogged. But they're 178 this week against Carlton Tags. And, and with that in mind... They're, you know, it's a pretty good price because they're, f- they're equal fourth, Carlton outside the eight. So you expect the Kangas to win, and that's not a bad price. It's not a bad price, and they could go a game clear of uh, fourth if July yeah, happen to beat Sydney. Which they will. Uh, but we'll look at Melbourne versus West Coast, and it's the Natanui Cup. Yeah, uh, well, the Jack the... Watts Cup. We're not quite sure yet. but You think they'll go that way? Yeah, that's the, the word. Natanui didn't dominate the Teal Cup as expected. so He might want to stay in Perth as well. Perhaps. Melbourne $1.86, West Coast $2.10, punters at your peril. Yeah. <laughs> this market. Can you, find a, can you find a winner there? Um, no. <laughs> I'm going to go for Melbourne. In a word, no. I'm going to go for Melbourne because last week was embarrassing and surely they can't put yeah. another, another dish on the table as bad as that one. Well, I'll go for West Coast because they beat right. my mob last week. Uh, the other one of interest is Brisbane versus the Bulldogs up at the Gabba. The Doggies, you've just told me, have lost two games this year, Where, uh, at, at two venues this year. Yeah, they've lost a handful of games twice to North at the Dome, of course, to Geelong, um, at Geelong. And they, tell, they don't play particularly well at Telstra Dome, believe it or not, and they win everywhere else, or they have th- thus far this year. So, so they're going to they're gonna have to win at the Gabba. I'll be favouring the Dogs, and Brisbane, of course, have been woeful in the last month and a bit, winning only one out of, I think, five, so have to go for the Dogs there. And that's, once again, at a pretty good price tag. Yeah, it's uh, $1.82, the Bulldogs, $2.14, Brisbane. So Brisbane look a bit under the odds there. Mm. Um, in the premiership market, Geelong continue to tighten, $1.67. Hawthorne, the next best, $4.70. The Dogs have been gapped. They're now $13.50, racing two. We've spoken about this a number of times. Geelong. Geelong. Um, Ablett three dollars twenty five. Harvey four dollars forty. The new second favourite. Bartell four dollars seventy. This is going to be a great one to bet in play on Brownlow night because Ablett's going to be in front as we know for a long way, and Harvey's going to come home like a train, and <laughs> it's going to be just a ripping in play spectacle. Tags. It will, and punters can get on over the phone on Betfair during uh, the count. You, you actually got a bit of inside gossip on from the Ablett camp overnight, I believe. Any, um, can you shed any light? I, I believe that they don't think he's going to win. Okay. That's all. That's there all, you are, punters. Close to the camp. Mm, that's right. <laughs> just, just purely because Very there's, close there's, to others, the camp. there's others in the market that yeah. might come over the top. Of course. Um, but it, it's, it's, it's interesting because there could be an ineligible player win this. Franklin and uh, Mitchell obviously yeah. polling Absolutely. probably pretty well. So uh, it could be an interesting night. Mm. NRL now, and we look at the Broncos versus the Dragons. $1.47, uh, the Broncos, and $3, the Dragon. And there's a bit of interest in this game because yeah. of the coaching. Exactly. Um, Wayne Bennett will be coaching his opposition of this week and next year. Yeah. Um, and Nathan Brown, the, the incumbent St George coach, has a very good record head-to-head against, against uh, the Broncos and Wayne Bennett. So given that point, $3 about St George is a pretty good price, I think. And, and Even up there? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. I think that's overs anyway. So it could be one of those ones to, to back them um, and then perhaps lay yeah. in play if, if they, uh, they do have a good start. start. Yeah, exactly. The Warriors versus the Sharks, $1.72. Warriors, Sharks, $2.26. Yeah, like Sharks here? on fire. I, I <laughs> yeah. think that's yeah. overs again. So two twenty six backers. Have a go at that. Fancy a couple of the away teams here. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, and the Storm, $1.22. Uh, warm favourites against the Roosters, $4.60. You want to say anything there, or should we skip right no, to the we'll premiership market? No, we'll skip right to the premiership market. Uh, $2.26, the Storm, Manly, $5.50, the Roosters, nine twenty, and the Broncos, nine twenty. Yeah, you have to say the Storm after last week's win over Manly. They were pretty solid, weren't they? Yeah. English Premier League, and we kick off this weekend, and we've been drawn into a tipping competition in the office, haven't we? I oh, know, we have, and I'd, yeah, I'd like to know a little more, so um, I think my, our, my form will get better in the next few weeks, <laughs> but uh, it's, once again, it's the, the big four dominating the, the premiership market tags, and... Yeah. It's, it's a little little boring. I was just about to say that. It, it, it will come to punters as no surprise that mm. Chelsea, Man United, Arsenal and Liverpool head the market. Yep. Chelsea, $2.82 are the favourites over Man United, $2.98. Arsenal, $6.20 and Liverpool, $8. And there's absolutely no hope for anyone yeah, else. Yeah, write your own ticket, the rest. 
Yeah. If Maybe you like anyone, it's going to be one of those four. 100, 100 200. Yeah. Try and trade out of the market there. Exactly. Um, A-League, we're going to be streaming to joint venture customers. We are. Who yeah. probably don't view, view this, unfortunately. That's right. Uh, punters in the UK uh, are able to watch the A-League where previously they weren't. So yeah. that's going to inject a fair bit of liquidity and solidarity into our markets. So soccer punters, our Betfair's A-League markets this year are going to be spectacular. Terrific. Look forward to seeing you next week.